This is my first time going to an abandoned theme park with roller coasters still left behind on the actual roller coaster. It is phenomenal find. I guess the only other theme park that I went to that had something left uh, was Chernobyl, uh, Pripyat, the town. They had the theme park in the middle of the town with the bumper cars. So that was kind of the only thing I've really been to that uh, had something left like that. Uh, but this is like kind of my first actual roller coaster. Do you guys enjoy roller coasters? Uh, for me personally, I was scared to death of them up until like maybe nine, 10 years old. And I went with my family, my dad and brother. And uh, my dad took us on this roller coaster. Um, I don't know if it was Knott's Berry Farm or somewhere in California. And it had like a double or triple loop. And I was scared to death, but I went on that. And I was like, oh, this ain't, this ain't that bad at all. So after that, gone on roller coasters ever since. I just love, love that adrenaline feeling. It's just a fun thing to do. Imagine if it just started to roll in.
looks like it might have been a carousel or something at one point. It looks like there's some other stuff over there, and I'm thinking that was probably where they had, you know, different uh, vendors, you know, with the food and maybe some games and. We are literally underneath the roller coaster right now. This is the big pulley wheel system that basically made the roller coaster move. Looks like it's very, very old. Before I forget, make sure you subscribe to my boy. Where is he? Uh, Matt Sonswa, go subscribe to him. Link's in the description. You already know what it is. Urban Exploring, Disney fanatic, that guy finds the coolest stuff in Disney that's abandoned and stuff, so go check him out, subscribe, and uh, either way, thanks for watching you guys, peace out, and keep following me and Matt, because we are on a journey to find the coolest abandoned spots known to man, so subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.